Hi, how are you? Matt Watson here from CarWow. Oh, I've got a bonkers drag race for you today. I'm in a highly tuned Audi TT RS by Storm Developments. Next to me is a highly tuned Audi R8 by Auto Talker. Next to that is a highly tuned Porsche 911 991 by ES Motor. It's going to be nuts. Let me tell you about this Audi. <laughs> It's got a 2.5 litre, five cylinder single turbo engine. But it's got one hell of a turbo on it. In fact, the engine's been built. It's had all manner of stuff done to it. It's had 80,000 pounds of work done to it. The result, 1,100 horsepower, 1,000 newton meters of torque, and a very scared presenter. The owner, Nick, in fact, if you want to follow his Instagram, it's LLF underscore Nick. The owner told me, I don't want to be going too much over 200 mile an hour because the brakes might be a bit sketchy. If you never see me again, it's been nice knowing you. Thanks for following me and all your support. <laughs> Let's move on to the Audi. 5.2 litre, naturally aspirated V10. And it's not naturally aspirated. They put two turbos on it and it runs on ethanol. It's now got 1200 horsepower and a whole bunch of torque. It's four wheel drive. You've got a dual clutch automatic gearbox. Price on that, 40 grand for the upgrades because it doesn't have a built engine. Finally, there we come to that Porsche. Now that normally has a 3.8 litre flat six twin turbo. It's still got twin turbos and it's still a flat six, but it's been built out to 4.2 litres. Result, 1100 horsepower, 1200 newton metres of torque. It's had everything done to it. The gearbox has been tuned. It's got special clutches in it, so the gearbox doesn't explode apparently. For that work, 90 grand. Then you've got to pay for the car on top of it. Same with that Audi. In fact, I'm getting so confused by it all. What I'm going to do is just give you the stats of the cars on the screen. Pause the video when I say, now, now. And that's all your stats. If you didn't get that, just rewind and watch it. And you can compare the stats. I've got a partner in crime today. Yanni. Are you going to come with me to the grave when we die in a horrible ball of flames or something? In these mad tuned cars. I'm very excited. I am a little nervous but I'm obviously in this absolute weapon. I'm a bit concerned for you because your brake calipers are tiny. Mm, and so are my balls right now. Yanni, I'm going to take you all day long. <laughs> the Smurf on the end's got some chat on him. I hope his reaction time's as good as his mouth. So basically guys, we've got a driver from ES Motors driving their own car. He's actually been working on that car till five in the morning, making it tip top for this drag race. So if he chokes on the launch, Oh dear, he's probably gonna get fired. Let's hope he doesn't. Right, I'll put links to everyone's Instagram who's helped us out in the description. Please check them out. Go check out their Instagrams and stuff like that. It really helps us out in getting cars from them in future. And as ever, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you won't miss a single upload. All right, let's get and do this. This is gonna be interesting. Buying a new car? Then head to CarWow and my team will help you find your next car at a fair price. Car Wow, your one stop car buying comparison site. Before we race, we're going to do the obligatory Car Wow sound check. I'm going to go first. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so good. Oh, oh. I think I just made a mess in my pants. Have a listen to your Audi, Yanni. Oh. I don't know which one's better, I can't decide. Can we have some Porsche? One second. You choked already and all you gotta do is rev the bloody engine. Yanni, do you need to show me how to start his car? Come on, mate. Oh, he's got it now. One nil to me. Now, do you know what? We're going to do something a little bit different here. Tune cars can sometimes be temperamental. You accept that when you get into tuning a car. And there is a chance that, like in previous videos, where the tune car can just go... Transmission's really not happy. Throwing a wobbly again. And basically itself. And so we're going to run this in reverse. We're going to do the drag race last. All right, let's do this. Rolling race, 50 miles an hour, cars in comfort, if there is such a thing in these things. Three, two... Come on, Ray. Three, two, one, go. Kick down. Whoa! It's not kicking down. It's just going. Ah! Ah! Oh! Crapping hell. Wow. 
This car doesn't seem to kick down, it just builds boost. Wow, 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 this car's fast, my God. Whoa! I've never driven this before, it's my first time in it. So let's just go with the rolling grace in sports mode and in manual mode, because then I won't just crawl away. All right, Matt, he needs to set this up, yes, yeah, so give me 30 seconds. Right, set it up now, now I need manual. Okay, so if you just go dynamic mode, manual wise. And then obviously mode. there, and then do my thing, yeah? <laughs> hell. Just press Yeah, press forward. it in, rev it up when he's going three, two, one, and then let it go. So what that does, when that's pressed forward and you floor it, you, it won't, the car won't go any quicker, it just builds boost. Yeah. So I need to stay at 50 to make sure it's cruising, yeah. As soon as you lift it up to the throttle, then that's it's like it a It's off. like a launch in midway. <laughs> Matt's smoking. Yeah, these brakes ain't great. 50 mile an hour, third. I'm gonna count it in, get level with me, ready? Three, two, one, go. Come on, come on, boost, there's a massive hole. There's a massive hole of torque. But then it goes, oh my God. But those are even quicker. These brakes are rubbish. Matt, that TT seemed a little bit slow and I know it's no slouch. So the TT, right, it's got a single turbo and it's a massive turbo, so there's this huge hole of torque. Now when it comes on boost, it's insane. Let's do the brake test. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why I'm gonna do this, because I'm gonna lose, but let's do it. Let's see how bad this is. <laughs> All right, now we have a brake test from 70 miles an hour. When we reach the line, full emergency stop. Ray, you've got to get level with Yanni, mate. Get level with Yanni. Come on, Ray, get level. Just stay level with Yanni, and Yanni, you stay level with me. This is going to do badly. The brakes are toast already. Soft pedal. The pedal is soft. Well done, Ray, you won. We need to do the final thing, the most important thing. We need to do the drag race. Don't lose to the TT. Why am I so worried? I'm worried and let's beat the Porsche off the line. Yeah, I think I'm ready. I'm so excited, I'm not gonna lie, it's the first time I've been so excited in a while. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I'm good. Three, Here we go. Two, one. <laughs> no launch. Like the launch control didn't engage. No, I was doing well. I think you got to so go there, MS, yeah? I okay, think that fine. Might be the problem. No, 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 no. What happened to you, Yanni? The launch control never engaged. It engages when I'm sitting here, but the minute I took my foot off the brake, it didn't go anywhere. The owner said to me, I can go auto, I can go manual. We tried auto initially, it didn't engage, so now I'm trying it in manual. Well, I'm in manual. Come on now. Do this. Three, two, one. Won't pull away. No. That's a ah, ah. Oh, you got an engine management line. You have to turn it off again and um, let it just reset. No! Ah. Not again! Oh, I'm gutted. I'm so gutted. Why do they keep stopping? That's exactly how it is, yeah? It's in dynamic. Yeah. Let me try. I mean, I'm concentrating so hard to change gears and time it. That's Won't allow me. It? So it's got to be just on the off mode. I did an amazing time, an amazing time. Just press that button again once. Well, now it should feel like boost. Yeah, it does. But it just don't take off. Oh, my God. What is going on? Literally, I come off yeah. and I've got nothing. Which of you guys thought that this was the car that would prove most problematic? Everyone thought that. Yeah, it's delivering over and over again. And I've won twice. Twice. Does the owner want to drive his own car? He can come in with me, Yanni. Yeah. He's done it over and over again. He's never tested launch before. It's a problem with the car, mate. It's not me. You have to do it normally. I'm going to do it normally. I'm 
I'm good to go. Gearbox on this, honestly, it's such a delay. I want a rematch. I want a rematch. This is quickest. I want a rematch. Who wants a rematch? I want a rematch. This car's serious. You've got enough fuel, haven't you? Yeah. I have to play around with the revs, rev it, drop it, drop it, and literally go probably about 3,000 yeah. and then go. It's a gear change, it's so hard to do. Put it at six then. I, I do, but it's got a delay yeah, on it really bad. Yeah. Matt did say that he messed up his gear change, so I think that this and the TT now will have a proper race. Yeah, yeah. Just down. really really pull it hard yeah okay i'll do it at six let's see what happens because once it starts going over at like seven if you don't catch it it's not all over the place isn't it it's got mine of its own yeah <laughs> team cars so ray can you not do another run now no not now it's getting way too hot man can you drive it up and down the runway quickly to just cool it down get some air in through it no my clutch is cool now Okay, Yannick. We want to have another race because you reckon you can do better. And I would like to see what that car can do when it fully performs. And what this one can as well, if I change gears perfectly. So let's try it. <sighs> Come on, don't fail me now. Come on. Talkie. Had to do him proud. And I would have taken the Porsche as well if that Porsche had come on the run with me. I had to come round here because I don't know where my walkie talkie went, it just flew everywhere. This car was really, really quick, but that was quicker. I wonder if that was quicker than the Porsche. It would have beaten the Porsche, I'm telling you. Oh. This is stupid. Fortunately, we know how quick the cars were and I'll reveal it now. So then what exactly happened? Well, the R8 won, completing the standing quarter mile in 9.4 seconds. Meanwhile, the TTRS took 9.9 .9 seconds. And Shane the Porsche dropped out as in the first race, it did a quarter mile time of 9.7 seconds. Hey, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Also, let me know if any other videos you'd like me to do in the comments below. If you click there, you can watch some more videos. And if you click on that box there, you can actually sign up to the Car Wow newsletter, where we'll keep you up to date of all the latest news and reviews from the car world in between these video uploads. So just click on that, sign up, it's completely free. And of course, you can cancel anytime you want to. Thanks for watching.